Next up, let's discuss the revolve command. The revolve command makes creating round parts simple, but there are a few important tips that can be helpful when you're getting started. With the revolve feature, you are rotating a profile to create a round part, and an important part of any revolve sketch is knowing where the revolve axis is. This will be the center of rotation for the revolve. In this example, we're going to start by sketching a horizontal construction line that will represent that revolve axis. Now we can start sketching the profile that we want to revolve. One great tip when sketching revolve profiles. If you dimension relative to a construction line, like I've done here, then move your cursor past that construction line, the dimension will automatically become a diameter dimension. Again, we are creating round parts, and in many situations, defining your sketch with diameter dimensions rather than radius values makes much more sense. Now that we have a sketch defined, it's time to create our revolve feature. While in the sketch, I can click on the revolve command from the toolbar. Because I've gone straight from the sketch to the feature, Onshape automatically adds my sketch to the revolve command. But you can see by the red highlighting of the feature that we still have one more requirement to fulfill, and that is the revolve axis. As mentioned earlier, think of the revolve axis as the center of rotation for your revolve. In our example, it's the very first horizontal construction line that I sketched. But it's important to point out in Onshape, there is no special axis feature. In this example, we're using a construction line, but you can use many different things as a revolve axis. For example, a solid line, an edge of a part, or even a cylindrical face. Here I'll click Revolve Axis in the dialog, then click on my horizontal construction line, and you can see we have a preview of our finished revolve. One last thing to mention about the Revolve command. Just below the Revolve Axis is Revolve Type. By default, Onshape assumes that you want a full 360 degree revolve, but you can change this by choosing a different revolve type in the dropdown. There are options for one direction and two direction, and you can flip the direction by clicking opposite direction. There's also a symmetric revolve type that revolves equally in both directions. The one direction, two direction, and symmetric revolve types will allow you to enter a revolve angle.